The Go to Carpathia certificates are granted by the Bieszczady Foundation for the best quality, environment-friendly ecotourism products and services available in the Eastern Carpathian Mountains. Certificate for the Magoda Cabin Tourist Farm for the accommodation services. Why the Magoda cabin? From our first names, Maciek and Jagoda. It was the idea of our friend from Holland, who's very creative about the Polish language. While we were thinking about the name, she came up with that idea, and we liked it. A life in the country, especially in a village in the Bieszczady Mountains, has got its own rhythm, different than in a town. We've got to, and want to, adjust to the seasons of the year. Thus, life acquires a completely new meaning, new tastes, colors and aromas. We live closer to the nature. We cannot really imagine a mountain house which is not made of wood. Only a few such houses have survived in the region. So our first cottage, the Magoda cabin, was brought to Lutowiska from the area of Rzeszów. It was there that we found a house of a required size. Since the very beginning, we have been planning to open a guest house, so it had to be big. The house is decorated to my liking. Some people like it, others not that much. Są osoby, którym się to podoba bardzo, innym się podoba mniej. A Boyko-style cottage is a consequence of the fact that we had bought land with such a cottage, and we found that it was our duty to renovate it. Lutowiska is a quiet village. Not many people, not many guest houses, restaurants, etc. So we do not have as many tourists here as, for example, in Vetlina, which looks like a major tourist resort. It is peace and quiet that our visitors seek. The scenic views of the mountains, the atmosphere and serenity. I have traveled all over the world. So I know what I missed in some of the places where I stayed. That's why the rooms are equipped with hair dryers and other such things, which are really appreciated while staying at a guest house or a hotel. Our house is vibrant with life. There are people whom we like, whom we befriend. Our guests keep coming back. We treat them as our good friends, not customers, just as the hosts of a house should treat their guests. That's why the house does not feel crowded. If people like each other, the space and distance are perceived differently. Even if as many as 10 people meet at the same table, they've got common topics, they've got similar outlooks on life, even on politics. <laughs> The 
Kitchen work is a must, so I've had to pitch up and learn how to cook. Our guests are the people who work for big corporations from dawn till dusk. They leave work and come back home at 9 o'clock in the evening, and homemade food is a rare treat for them. That's why they can appreciate that everything here is cooked by me, that the products are fresh, straight from the garden or the hen. It's very satisfying to cook for the people who crave traditional homemade cuisine. I would never change this place for a town, unless I lost my mind, but hopefully I'm not in immediate danger of it. <laughs>